Hey guys, sitting out here at the farm with the Revolution, and I'm going to try something that I did, try to repeat something that I did when I was 10 years old, and that was shoot a bird out of the air with a rifle. Now, before we get started on any of this, I got to make clear that, let me show you this. This farm is out here in the middle of nowhere. I'm going to be lobbing lead into the air, but the closest farm, I don't know if you can see it there, I got this up as high as I can. The closest farm is over a mile away. Actually, it's about two miles away. So there's no chance that any of these pellets are going to land anywhere near people at all. They're all going to be landing out in cornfields. I don't need to say it, do I? Don't do this in a suburban area. Don't be stupid. Uh, I got the scope dialed all the way down to six power. I'd prefer lower if I could. And that gives me a wider field of view. Um, I don't suspect I'm going to get any, to be honest. It's hard. It's really hard. Uh, to shoot a bird out of the air. And this is going to be in slow motion, so I know that you're going to be saying, fire, fire, the crosshairs are right where you want them to be. But my mind doesn't work in one eighth time like the camera does. But anyway, it'll be entertaining at a bare minimum. And if any of them come down, if it ain't a perfect kill, of course, I have a really fast follow-up shot with the semi-automatic gun. The pigeon's flight pattern is actually right behind me around this corner. I just hide behind the wall here. Obviously, the goal would be to have them coming straight on at me. That'd be the easiest shot, but I'll take side shots and everything, and we'll just see what happens. You know, I'm not going to have this semi-automatic for very long, so I need to try something that I know I couldn't do with my single shot, and this is it. Okay, enough jibber-jabbering. Let's get to it. Alright guys, there's a lot of great footage of pigeons running for their lives, so if you'd like that in slow motion, keep watching. It is pretty fun, and eventually, if I keep this long enough, I'm going to get one of these darn pigeons out of the air. So I call this piece, Dance of the Sugar Plum Pigeons. Enjoy.